Well, can you please tell the dean there's been an egregious error? I belong at Metropolis University, not walking the halls of Podunk High. Well, yes, I'm sure that we could work this all out if you could just get him to call me back. Thank you. You know, you spent as much time studying as you did trying to leave. You'd be in college already. And where'd you get that pearl of wisdom? The farmer's almanac? Mm -hmm. So, what do you think? They're not really your colors. They're the school's colors. I'm glad you made the team, Clark, but why be a conformist? At least with the whole farm boy plaid thing, as lame as it is, it completely belongs to you. In the future, let's restrict our conversations to hello. I can't goodbye. believe she even tried out. I know, did you see what you were wearing? And those thighs? One, two, three, no! no. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, the party's gonna be way Yeah, pool party. Great. Great. Where are we? Some kind of freakish feminist parallel universe? Hey, Chloe, have you seen the way these football players are acting? Yeah, and I noticed one of them unloaded a shotgun in the boys' locker room. I was thinking you were maybe doing an article on it, but the only two reporters I have are late again. Oh, hi. It's you. Uh, sorry, I was storming the gates of Metropolis U trying to get them to change their admissions policy. And I had to pick up my new jacket. What do you think? It's not exactly your colors. <clears throat> It's the school colors. Whatever. Anyway, Lois, I need you to go to the Smallville Medical Center. Apparently, our gun-toting ex-quarterback woke up this morning and he's feeling the sting of his second-degree burns. He's been apologizing nonstop, so... I'm sure he doesn't love the prospect of playing tight end for the Kansas State boys' home. <laughs> Hello? Yes, I will hold for the dean. I've got to go. All right, I guess I'll go to Smallville Medical Center. Clark, I need you to talk to Coach T. After all, you were there. Nice save, by the way. Actually, Chloe, with this whole football thing, I'm gonna have to dial back my time at the torch. Oh. I guess I've got my work cut out for me. I'm sorry. You know, my priorities... You know what? Don't worry about it. This has got to be a pretty big deal for you. I mean, you're the new starting quarterback, right? It's got to be pretty exciting. It is, but I'm just not sure the other guys want me around. They've been playing together for three years. You're on the team for two weeks, and all of a sudden you're starting? What did you expect, hugs and kisses? <laughs>